try and cut through the bottom of this stuff, I guess. It's definitely pretty bricked up, so it's definitely frozen. What's up guys, welcome back to another David's Outdoors YouTube video. Today, just got a call that I gotta go clean out a guy's iced up, frozen, snow packed, drifted driveway. So let's hop in the tractor, let's go drive down the road and let's go clear this guy's driveway. Okay, so basically, I got a call from a guy. I'm sure as a lot of you guys know, it has been, for a lot of you guys, it's been extremely cold. Right now, we're at about negative 10 degrees um, outside right now. Like in fact, even the front of my, Front, of, front windshield is fogging up on me right now and can't see a whole lot out of it. So let me turn up the heat quick. Um, so this guy called, he had not been around for the last couple snowstorms. So he had let the snow pile up on his, on his driveway and then let it freeze. So the negative 15, negative 20 degree temperatures along with the wind chills caused more drifting to come into the driveway, caused it to freeze solid. So we're going right now. Of course, I didn't have time to take the Frontier inverted snowblower off the back. So I've only got the, I've got the Frontier snowblower on the back and I've got my bucket. So I'm hoping that we can just take my tractor and kind of dig his driveway out with the bucket. It's not going to look super professional, but it's just kind of a one-time service. So that's where what, what we're on our way to do right now. But I just kind of wanted to get on here and say thank you guys so much. We have literally gone from a thousand subscribers just a few days ago to now 1,400. 1,400 subscribers. And I just want to thank each and every one of you guys for tuning in every day, um, you know, for watching the videos and for liking, commenting, sharing everything, subscribing. Thank you guys so much. I. You know, I never thought that I would truly grow as fast as I have. I never thought I would get this big in general, but you guys have made it happen and it's just absolutely amazing. So thank you guys so, so much from the bottom of my heart for taking the time out of your day to watch these videos, for following me, you know, keeping up with, keeping up with my life and what we've got going on on a day-to-day -day basis. It just, it means a lot. So thank you guys so much for, for taking the time to do that. And, uh, I hope you guys enjoy the videos. Please let me know if you guys are enjoying them. Please let me know what you guys would like to see more of. Let me know how cold it's been for you guys. It's been just bitter, bitter, bitter cold over here. I think the coldest that it has gotten so far has been negative 20 degrees with a wind chill of about negative 70 here in, here in South Dakota. So it's been cold. So let me know how cold it's been for you guys. It's dogs got to almost carry the dogs outside. I, I've been having to go outside with the dogs to go to the bathroom. And once they go, I just scoop them up and bring them right back inside or else they've, they've been getting little frostbite scares on their paws. So poor little, poor little dogs are not like this weather. I'm sure. I know why. <laughs> I haven't liked it either. So luckily uh, we were supposed to get a snowstorm to accompany all this cold front, but didn't end up coming or coming to fruition or happening. So we got a little bit lucky not having to deal with that. So I'm thankful for that. So I will uh, catch back up with you guys once I'm at the house.
Okay guys, so we just got back and I'm out of breath because I ended up taking the Frontier snowblower off the back and these hydraulic hoses were frozen and they still are. So I was out there with a hammer. You can see I can't move. This is the only one that moves. I was out there with a hammer and just trying to get it off and it took a while. So that and the three point pins were stuck frozen on. So I'm just glad that that is off. Now I can hook it back up to the Norman and not worry about that because that snowblower will be sold here at the end of the month. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Again, thank you guys so much for 1400 subscribers and I hope you guys are still enjoying the videos. Please let me know what you think about this video. It's a different style. I didn't talk as much. I just kind of let you guys watch the work that was being done with the tractor. So please leave in the comments if you like this style of video or if you like more when I'm talking. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Please like the video, comment, share, whatever you guys want to do. And I thank you guys so much. We'll see you in the next video.